If you thought the dog was at fault, I'd tell you to pick again. I've had a lot of cases in my life, and I can't ever recall recovering anything from a dog. Now, the dog's owner, depending on what municipality, what city, what state, may be some liability on the owner for a violation of leash laws and not keeping the dog properly contained inside of a yard or something like that. But in my estimation, like I've been doing this 30 years, the main person who would be at fault would be the driver that rear ends the driver in front. Now, you don't want to jump to that conclusion immediately either because there's something in the law called the sudden emergency doctrine. And sometimes there exists a situation as this one where a dog scrambles into oncoming traffic and no one could reasonably expect that the dog would do that. And if you look at this dog, that is one of the luckiest dogs you've ever seen in your life. But the person who's hitting behind is probably at fault with the exception that there could be a sudden emergency doctrine that the driver or the insurance company would put up against that person.